Hey guys, it's Trill again, and this will just be a short update video about the new Operation Bloodhound update that got released tonight, and I will tell you everything you need to know about this update during this video. In order to get access to the new Operation, you will need to purchase this Operation Bloodhound access pass from the main menu of CSGO. This will cost you 5 euros and 49 cents, or 5 dollars and 99 cents depending on your current location, and will give you access to a lot of cool new features. After you purchase, you will get this Bronze Operation Bloodhound coin in your inventory, which you can grade up to a silver and gold coin by completing missions from the two Operation campaigns Marksman and Revolution that offer 60 missions in total. As in previous operations, you will have to earn challenge stars in order to upgrade your coin by completing a mission path. Depending on the difficulty of the mission path, you can either earn 1, 2 or 3 challenge stars. A new feature that I personally really like is a short intro with voiceover before starting a mission. Hello. My name is Sebastian Enke, and I'll be your CO for Operation Bloodhound. Our purpose? Track down one of the most dangerous operators working for the Phoenix. Under my training, you will become more than a soldier. You'll become a hunter. But before we begin our work with a rifle, you have to learn how to live long enough to get one. Become an expert with your sidearm. It's the fastest way to get the resources you'll need. Another new feature is a profile rank system that you can rank up by earning experience points. You can earn XP by completing matches in any mode you want and more importantly by completing missions. Your mission manual will exactly tell you how many XP you can earn by completing a mission. Be sure to read this every time before starting a mission because this will also tell you how you can earn an additional XP bonus. Once you connect it to the server you can open the scoreboard at any time to check the current mission you are playing and your progress down here. When you play on the server until the round finishes, you will see how many XP you are earned during this match and also see a progress bar that will tell you how close you are to the next rank up. How cool is that? By completing a match, you can obviously also get lucky and get one of the new Operation Falcon cases dropped. Speaking of which, there are obviously a bunch of new skins added to the game. Right here you can see all new weapon skins from the Falcon case. The Falcon case also comes with a custom knife, the Falcon knife, that comes in 13 different paint styles. Right here you can see what the knife and knife animation looks like in-game. Another thing that also came with this update are a bunch of new knife sounds. Then we also have three new weapon collections that come with a variety of pretty cool new skins that you can obtain as a public drop. And last but not least we also have six more or less new maps added to the matchmaking pool. The maps are Rails, Resort, Zoo, Lock, Season and Agency. I won't be showing these maps in detail in this video since I want this to be as short as possible, but if you want me to, I could upload some gameplay videos on all these maps in the next couple of days. Let me know if you'd be interested to see that by leaving a comment below and please excuse me now, I have a bunch of missions to complete. See you guys next time.